Welcome to Vlogmas day four. <laughs> Good morning, you guys. It is currently like 10.15 right now. I have to leave to take Andrew to work in like 10 minutes. I woke up not too long ago. I'm exhausted. I went to bed late again. I'm going to try and fix my sleep schedule in the next couple days because I cannot keep going to bed so late. But when I get back from taking Andrew, I'm going to get a coffee from Duncan on my way back. And then I'm going to have a bagel for breakfast because in my house we always have bagels on Sundays. And I love, I love bagel Sundays. They're the best. And then the Steelers should be coming on at 1. And then we're supposed to be decorating and bringing down the tree. I don't know if we're going to put on the ornaments all in one day, but we have to like fix the branches and get the tree up and stuff like that. Hopefully today, which I'm very excited for. And yeah, we'll just have like a very self-care relaxing Sunday. It looks very sunny outside, which is nice compared to yesterday's weather. But good morning, everyone. He's always in the same spot in the morning. Why is he inside the wind? Oliver. Good morning. He looks so cozy in this chair. Hi, yes. Can I get a large mocha iced coffee with extra cream and liquid sugar? That's it. Alright, thank you. Alright guys, I'm back. I got some coffee and now it is time to have some bagels for breakfast and I'm so excited. Guys, I'm hurting. It's so bad. I keep being a girl sometimes, especially once a month. We also got the tree out. We're gonna be putting that up later. And the Steelers game is starting soon. Wish me luck, guys. We won two games in a row. Guys, I put up these houses and like these little people all along the TV here. This one doesn't light up. But this one does. I just didn't plug it in yet. Look how pretty they look. I don't know why there's a knife there. Nicholas left a knife there. That doesn't belong there. Look how nice. Guys, it's a very sad day. The nutcracker is broken. His head is just completely off. It's only connected by the hair. I went to put up all the houses and stuff. And I was like, hmm, I'll put this nutcracker up. I can't. Because it's broken. <laughs> it looks so funny. Guys, Oliver is obsessed with getting into this tree box. He keeps going in there. Get out. I don't know why he wants to be in here so badly. He loves boxes. <laughs> I don't get it. I haven't updated you guys in a little bit, but... I'm having meatloaf for dinner. My mom made meatloaf and then I made the mashed potatoes. I'm very excited, I'm really hungry. So uh, we have a little bit of an issue. Day two of the Christmas tree fail. So we put together the middle and the bottom piece of the tree, but I guess they ended up missing the top part of the tree because it wouldn't fit in this box. So they put it in a different bag or something. And now they don't know where they put it. So we have an uncompleted tree right now. <laughs> Seriously think that they would lose their heads if they weren't connected to their body. Also, I'm watching Home Alone. I love this movie so much. It's one of my favorite Christmas movies. It's a classic. So we still have to like continue to fix the branches on the tree because it's kind of a disaster tree. I don't know. The branches just never move in like the right way. We've always had like issues. And we just got this tree. I don't know why. It just has so many problems. So if we can't find the top piece, I really have no idea what we're going to do. Like, are we going to buy another tree? I have no idea. But it does give us a little bit more time. It's only the 4th of December. Um, gives us a little bit more time to actually, like, make the branches look nice. I think right now I'm going to continue reading this book. I should probably finish it either today, hopefully tonight maybe, or tomorrow morning. And I'm going to watch 
Home Alone. Also, the Cowboys play tonight, so maybe I'll watch some Sunday night football. My cramps are kind of killing me. I took something, so hopefully that kicks in. I might have a little drink tonight to celebrate the Steelers win. We'll see. Depends if my cramps fully go away. If not, I probably won't. But yeah, I'm gonna read. I also wanna take a shower before I go to sleep. I don't know if I wanna wash my hair tonight or maybe I'll do it like when I wake up tomorrow. We'll see. Guys, we have a new king of the house. <laughs> king Oliver. <laughs> this is his seat now. Look how cute he is. Hello. Hi, Oliver. He's like, please stop interrupting me. I'm trying to sleep. Guys, it is like 1.30, I think, or something like that. And I am exhausted. Today's been such like a chill day because it's the rest of my period. And I spent most of the day having cramps and just like laying on the couch. But it actually wasn't that bad of a day. The Steelers won, which is pretty crazy. They won two games in a row. Kind of crazy. They haven't done that all season so far. So I'm very happy about that. Um, and I read a lot of my book. I think I'm almost done. I have like 50 pages left and I'm too tired to finish it tonight. So I'll just do that tomorrow. As soon as I wake up tomorrow, I'm gonna take a shower because I need to wash my hair. And yeah, I'm gonna try and actually get a good night's sleep tonight and not go to bed at like 4 a.m. like I've been doing. It's so terrible. So I'm gonna try and just lay down and relax. I'm gonna do my five minute journal really quick. I have to brush my teeth, and then we'll get into bed and put on a movie. I think I want to put on a Christmas movie. Let's see. I'm trying to decide what Christmas movie to watch. I was like, either between Elf or The Grinch. And then I was thinking to myself, do I really want to watch a Christmas movie? And then I saw Friends with Benefits is on HBO. And I love this movie, so then I was like, maybe I should watch this instead. But I need to go to sleep soon, and if I put this on, I'm going to want to watch it and pay attention to it. So I think I'm going to lean more towards Elf. Also, I kind of want to watch Spider-Man 3, but that's so long, and I'll be up late again. So you know what? We're putting on Elf. I've made up my mind. This is a very important question. If any of you guys use either Spotify or Apple Music also actually has like, it's not as good as Spotify wrapped, but it, it does the same thing. It shows you like your top artists, your top songs, so it makes you like a playlist. So it's basically the same thing. Spotify is just looks better, which doesn't really matter in my honest opinion. I feel like they're both pretty much the same thing. But my top five artists, number one was Taylor Swift, and number two was Billie Eilish. I think I told you guys that yesterday. But then my third was Lana Del Rey, and then my fourth was Louis Capaldi, and my fifth was Tate McRae. And I actually had Apple Music most of the year, but then I switched back to Spotify. I used to have a Spotify and then for some reason I just wanted to switch to Apple Music because I liked the way it looked better. So then I actually got Apple Music and now I think I prefer Spotify. So I had like a three month free trial in October. So I used Spotify from October till now. So my Spotify wrapped for that is only a couple months. My Apple Music top five artists I think were... Taylor Swift, Billie Eilish, Harry Styles, One Direction. I'm not sure who the fifth person is, but pretty much the same people. Um, I honestly thought Harry Styles was going to be on my Spotify wrapped also, but I guess I listened to Lana Del Rey, and Louis Capaldi shocked me because I don't listen to his music that much. I have like a couple songs. 
by him that I like adore. But let me know who your like top artists are, your top five, and let me know like your top three songs of the year because I'm really generally curious. I love just seeing everybody's different music tastes. I think music is like my favorite thing in the world and I love talking about music. So let me know in the comments. All right, guys, it is time. I'm going to edit this vlog and watch Elf and fall asleep and get a good night's rest because I definitely need it and I deserve it. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching today's vlog and I'll see you guys tomorrow. We're already pretty much five days into Vlogmas. The time is just going by too fast and I still haven't started Christmas shopping for anybody yet. I need to start soon because Christmas will be here before I know it. And saying that just stresses me out. But I'm exhausted. I'm so ready to go to bed. I'll see you guys tomorrow.